Hey guys, today we're going to talk about modular arithmetic, which is a really important technique to learn for code busters. Um, it'll be very useful, especially in RSA and also in Affine, which we'll get to uh, very soon. And also the concept of mod uh, 26 is just basically applied all over code busters. To understand modular arithmetic, let's start with an analogy with a clock. So we all know that on the clock there we can show 12 hours. 1, 2, 3, 4, through 12. But what happens when the 13th hour hit, uh, say like in military time? Well, 13, uh, we know from military time, is 1 o'clock. You basically count one more over 12, and then you start over again. And 14 maps on to 2, 15 maps on to 3 o'clock, etc., etc. And the same concept can be used in modular arithmetic, where basically, once you go over 25, you start at zero again, and you start a new round of counting. So here are some examples. Let's take, first of all, 53. So here's what we're going to do in um, 53. In 53, we can count 126. If we subtract from it, that gives us 27. And from 27, how many 26s can we count? We can also take out 1. So that gives us 1. This means that there are in total two 26s in 53, and when we transfer it into mod 26, we're going to note that uh, the answer is going to be 1. So the equivalent sign basically means kind of equals but in modular terms. Uh, so that reads as 53 is the equivalent to 1 in mod 26. Um, similarly, let's take a look at 78. So 78, we can take out 1, uh, 26, that gives us 52. 52, uh, if you know your math, we can know that there are two 26s in 52, and that gives us a remainder of 0. So 0 will be the uh, equivalence of 78 in mod 26. So as you can see, this is basically kind of applying the remainder um, of, say, um, divided by 26 by a number, um, and that's basically what you get for the mod value. So in, get case, in that case, we can know that, oh, 275 divided by 26, so 126, 15, 0. There's no more um, 26s in 15. So 275 um, in mod 26 will be 15. It's basically the remainder after you divide the whatever number you have by 26. Also run into negative numbers, which can also be still changed into mod 26. If you recall from our um, Caesar video, uh, when we come into um, we come in touch with negative numbers, we basically add 26 to whatever the number is, and that's basically the same idea, and negative 1 is uh, 25 in terms of mod 26, and similarly, negative 17 is 9 in mod 26. So basically, that's how you get to it, and yeah.